from Philadelphia, all set for baseball from the home of the Phillies, Citizens Bank Park. Tonight, it's an NL Eastern Division showdown between the Atlanta Braves and the Philadelphia Phillies. Division. Now to the plate, Ozzy Albies, and we are set for baseball here this evening. Leading off tonight for Atlanta, the second baseman. Hit hard toward the right side. He leaps, but he can't get it. It's down for extra bases. And the Braves have something going right away. It's a leadoff double. Now that is the way you want to start a game on the road. He comes out swinging and stands at second as the first base runner of the night. Now we'll see if his teammates can pick him up and if they can punch first. Dansby Swanson lining up to hit. Looking to get something to the right side with that leadoff man at second to start the ball game. Swing and a liner. But this will be pulled in out there in left center. Well hit, but a rough out number one. So next up will be Freddie Freeman. His past line against Aaron Nola. He's picked up 14 hits in 51 at bats. He also has one home run. That's in there. Base hit. And the run will score as the Braves strike first, deleted 1 0. Hey, not an easy cool. thing to do early the against this good pitcher, D Roll. Base hit and a 1 0 lead right away. As an offense, they talked about this, wanting to get to this guy early before he settles in. When they grab their gloves to go out on defense, they know they got a lead on their hands. And he comes in as a player to watch out for, hitting well over 300 on the season. That evens it up 1 and 1. Freeman stands at first with one out. And he takes one off the inside corner for ball two. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. Center fielder giving chase. He tracks it down and makes the play to record the second out. Next, it'll be Marcelo Zuna. He takes his first cuts in this one with a man at first and two away. Swing and a miss out in front of a changeup. For most people, being down 0 1 would seem like a lot, but this guy is such a good hitter. He doesn't care going deep in the count. He's got runners on base. He has a game plan every time he comes to the plate. Let's see how this one plays out. Shooting for that low inside corner, but he missed with it. One and two. As a hitter, you got to be staunch in your game plan. You know he has a nasty changeup, and you got to fight to make sure it's in the zone. That's a great take right there. Quinn will get there, and he puts it away to retire the side. Braves get a couple of hits. Ready now is Alec Bohm entering this one with a top 10 National League batting Billy. average mark. What a terrific win. season this Alec. guy's having. Up near the leaders in batting average, without a doubt the highest average and the best hitter on this team. Well, boys, these Braves, as they take the field here tonight, they've been fairly punchless of late, losing last time out and, in fact, dropping six of their last seven. Yeah, Matty, this definitely looks that like a situation second. where somebody's going to have to call a team meeting. I don't know if it comes from a veteran or the manager decides to close the doors for a second, but this team has not played well. They find themselves losing lately. They lost the last game, and they're going to need a spark to get this thing turned around. The 1-1 one -one is looked at for ball number two. One out, nobody on. Cutter, and that's a called strike two. Two balls, two strikes. down the left field line and deep but this will wind up being a foul ball here's another two two ball three three and two now well you don't see it all that often but this might be a good time for a three two change if he can look high and deep to right center Acuna going back and just short of a home run this ball's off the wall and he is in at second base with a one out double. Every hitting coach that in the league hurt. will tell you it only the takes right one swing of the bat to get oh. out of a slump, and maybe that's what Harper. we're seeing right here. He's been struggling, no doubt about it, but he's able to lace this thing off the wall, and he's standing at second with some newfound confidence. 
Another one fouled off, and he's quickly behind 0 and 2. Nothing in two count, and the pitch. And it's fouled away. Here comes another 0 2. That misses 1 and 2. Hey, the fish ain't biting there on that 0 2 breaking ball, but you got to be careful because this pitcher might throw him another one. On to Freeman at first, and there are two away now. That so stepping in is Reese Hoskins. Potential tying run for him at third Hoskins. base. Strike one to start the at bat. The 0 1 offering in the air down the line and left. On the move is Ozuna. Into the corner, he makes the catch to end the inning. Second inning set to go, and that'll bring in the veteran catcher, Travis Darno. Travis Darno. On a line, that's a base hit in the left field. That had to be in the scouting report right there. You don't see too many 0-0 oh -oh breaking ball ambushes in the game. And he had to know that pitch was coming. In now, Austin Riley. 0-1 the count. Hard hit ball to second. A bare hand for one. On to first to complete the double play. So base is empty now after the double play and at the plate will be the speedy outfielder Christian Pache. This is popped up Hoskins moving to his left and that's the third out one hit in the end. Here's Andrew McCutcheon now as they'll have five six and seven here to start the whole half of the second and the 34 year old veteran looks at a cold strike it's 0 and 1. Your eyes light up from the offensive side playing in a hitter's park like this. Have to get the ball up to do some damage. I'm not mad at that take. Fouled off. Ozuna is there and he makes the catch for the out. That is good. Next to hit is JT Realmuto. Real Utah. Cut fastball taken for strike one. All one to count. Swing and he puts a charge into this one. High and deep. And you can't forget about it. This ball is gone. Well, this is something you don't see every day. It had the distance the second it left the bat. But it was anybody's guess whether it was going to be fair or foul. That is, until it clanked off the top of the that foul pole. No question or controversy Dini. now. That's an impressive homer. Didi Gregorius set the plate now as he looks at strike one. Strike call. Tough to do much with that one. Gregorius is unlike many of today's hitters in the sense that he doesn't have a lot of swing and miss in his approach at the plate. More often than not, he gets contact, and I'm sure that makes him a frustrating hitter to face from a pitcher standpoint. You know, he takes his chances when he has count leverage, without question. 1 0, 2 0. You'll see this guy try and get nasty a little bit, but he stays within himself. He knows what his strengths are, and he tries to drive the ball right back where it came from. I know he missed with a fastball right there, but this guy's arsenal, you can't figure out what he's trying to do. He's got a lot of different directions he could go in right here. And he fouls this one off. Keeps fighting him off. The eighth pitch of the at bat coming up. And he misses this one inside, and that'll run things full three and two. Hey, this has been an epic at bat right here. I don't blame the pitcher for a little nibbling right there. Maybe get a swing and a miss. He didn't bite on that one, so now we go full count. There's nope. ball four. That's it. Next here is Roman Quinn. First shot for him here with a runner at first now and one away. No balls and one strike. Now he turns and smokes this one into deep center field. Acuna is there to put it away and the runner will be forced to retreat back to first. So next to hit is Aaron Nola. No balls and a strike to count. Set. Here's the 0 1. This one's flared toward left center. Swanson is there, and the side is retired.
but a run scores in the inning, and that'll have to be good enough as this solo home run knocks the. Now with the plate is Drew Smiley, nine one and two do up. Pitcher, Drew Smiley. Late on that one as it's fouled off to the left side. Into the windup, here comes the 0 and 1. Pulled toward right center field. Quinn is there, and he has it for the first down. The battle. So one gone for the Braves here in the third, and that'll bring up the exciting Ozzy Albies. Drops in a strike to start the at bat. Nothing and one. Early swing there as he pulls it foul to the right side. Line toward right center. And that's into the outfield for a one out base hit. So a ringing single here to center field makes it two hits for him on the night. And you can see there where he ranks on the Braves team leaderboard. Currently tops on the ball club in that category. And next will be Dansby Swanson digging in. Here comes the 0 1. Oh, and he's really getting the better of him now. It's strike two. Hit back up the middle. Segura to his left. He's there. The second for one. On the first. And for the second time in three innings, they've bounced into a double play. And with this one, the side is retired. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. And set to go as the third baseman, Alec Bohm. As the first pitch to him is in there for a called strike one. A ball and a strike to the Phillies' leadoff man. This is on the ground over to first. Freeman is up with it, and he'll step on first himself for the out. So one gone here in the Philadelphia third, and that'll bring in Gene Segura. Fastball taken, but that gets the zone for a strike. And a cut fastball, but this bounces near the plate for a ball. The 1-1. Nope, that's the ball. Hey, after the double in his first at bat, looks like he's trying to pitch around this guy a little bit. Philly shortstop in front of the count, three and one. Good job to work the count and put himself back in the driver's seat. Started off with one strike, and now he's got the count in his favor, three and one. Pache is there, two down. So the bases are empty with two gone now, and that'll bring in a dangerous hitter indeed in the form of Bryce Harper. Good swing, just got to try and straighten that one out. 0 oh, and 1, the count to Bryce Harper. High fly ball out to straightaway center. The Cunha finds some space out there for the catch to retire. Now here's the first offering. Not surprisingly here this is on the ground to the right side throw to first in time one gone here in the fourth. So bases are empty with one out now and that'll bring up the always dangerous Ronald Acuna Jr. Hit in the air to shallow center. Under it now is Segura and he's got it two away now. Now that the left field. Here's Marcelo Zuna. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Hit hard on the ground to second. Gregorius is there. Throw on to first. A three pitch. Hit. And we're back from Citizens Bank Park in Philadelphia. Let's check in with Heidi Watney. First pitch on its way. For the Phillies. Reese Hoskins. The first base. Will stand in for the second three. time now as he looks at a called strike. Hoskins. It's nothing in one. Smoked on the ground up the middle. A dive, but he can't get a glove on it. It's through for a base hit. Nice execution right there, Dan. Kept his front shoulder in, kept his hands inside the baseball, and ripped the base hit up the middle. If you're a pitcher right there, you can't get discouraged. Sometimes, even when you make a good pitch, 
Meanwhile now this is a fair ball down the line in left and that ought to be good for extra bases. And they've really got something going here. Runners at second and third to start the now inning. Batting. Catcher. JT. Stepping in now. JT will use it. Finally they show. And the tag will be too late as they take the lead now at two to one. Now back. Next to stand in is D.D. Gregorius. Worked the war his first time up. Strike one to start the at bat. Pulled toward right center field. Acuna giving chase. But it's the right fielder that gets there to make the catch. And that's the first out of the inning. And add a run on the sacrifice fly as that'll make this a three to one game. The center fielder. Number three. Ready to deal. Here comes the first oh, pitch. Win. And he misses with it one and one. Quinn, a 27 year old, he was taken in the second round back in 2011. Yeah, he has turned himself into a really nice ball player. I wouldn't put him on a superstar level, but you know what? They didn't miss with this pick either. You go into high rounds and you carve out a career the way this guy has, nice pick. Acuna is there now and he has it two gone. Now back. The pitcher. Heading out toward shallow right. No He's on. under it, and that ends the inning. Welcome back. Heidi Watney standing by as we get set for the top of the fifth. So here is Travis Darno. He singled in his first A.B. Offense needs to get going right here. You want to try and tighten up this game a little bit before it starts to get into that territory where you're going to start seeing the back end of each bullpen. Now batting. Hey guys, he's lucky he's getting this baseball back. He hung that middle of the plate. The batter's eyes lit up and he was able to put good wood on it. Softly hit down to third, likely no shot at two. There's one on the first, but not in time as he's in there ahead of the throw. Now batting. One out, runner at first. And up next will be Christian Pache. He's set and the pitch. Big swing and a miss at the knuckle curve, strike one. Pitcher wants to have a quick inning right here, capitalize on the momentum his batters have. Grounded back up the middle to second for one. On to first as they get the double play to get him out of. Bottom of the inning now, and that'll give way to the third baseman, Alec Bohm, hit in the air down the right field line. And this will wind up a foul ball. And now pitch on the way. Ground ball left side. And a base hit so the leadoff man is on to begin the inning. Up next and now Gene Segura. He's one for two in this one. Just off the outside that time laid off for a ball. Man he just missed the zone right there. One of the toughest pitches in the game that backdoor cutter. As an offensive player, you give up on that pitch. As soon as it comes out of the hand, next thing you know, it's trying to grab the corner. Line toward the alley in left center. Ozuna, a range to his left as he tracks this one down in left center for the first down. The right first shooter. offering. Number three. Bryce Harper Five. stands in as he looks at a cold Harper. strike. Hey, I still believe in my heart the best pitch is a well executed fastball down and away, and that's exactly what that is. He swings at that. That's off the end of the bat. That's not hard contact at all, and that's an easy out for the defense. Hits are even right now at five aside. Fouled away. Fouled off. The next one two pitch. I'll tell you right now he let go of that one and he wanted to pull it back. That was a hanger bad spot over the harder plate. He's lucky. He's lucky that's getting sent back to him. Oh, and he can only battle for so long as he's finally set down here after an eight pitch at bat from the stretch. Reese Hoskins is in for the third time now as he takes a called strike. It's 0 and 1. Hoskins behind to count 0 and 2. Hey that's the modern game right now north south elevate that high fastball and bury stuff in the dirt completely different from the east west we came up playing. Now here's one high and deep to left if it stays fair it's gone and this will wind up being nothing more than a long foul ball and it'll hold the count at 0 and 2 and a good two strike pitch but he misses high one and two. 
If I'm in the box, you take a step out right here. Take a deep breath after that high fastball. You've got to be leery of him. Uh, we'll have to leave it there as the play is made. For New inning set to get underway and set to stand in as the veteran pitcher, Drew Smiley. Line drive snagged on a short hop. Throw to first gets him, so the leadoff man's retired here to begin the sixth. Next, it'll be Ozzy Albies. Last time through was a base hit. Lays off 1-0. Oh. We're in the sixth inning here in a 3-1 ball game. A ball and a strike now. There's a pitch we haven't seen in a while. It's going to be tough on the hitters if they have to incorporate that into their mindset. Fouled off again, and now he's in a one and two hole. Into the windup and the pitch. Oh, and he gripped that one a bit too tightly as it broke down and just about got him. Skied into straightaway right. Harper has a read on it. And he brings it in for the second out of the inning. The bat Stepping the up is Dansby Swanson. 0 for 2 Dansby. from him so far in this one. Grounded down the third baseline. Reined in. Throw in time and the side is retired. Down. First pitch on its way. Leading off for the Phillies. Andrew McCutcheon the is at the plate field. as he takes a cold Andrew. strike one. McCutcheon. Swing and he takes this the other way to right. Pache is there one away. Now JT Maddie. Will Muto Catcher. will stand in here hoping Catchy. to duplicate what he did back Real in the second Catcher. inning as we flash you back to take another look at his solo home run that helped get this offense rolling. Shocked he didn't let it fly right there. Usually you're looking for a fastball elevated to get the party started. Real Muto behind with an 0 and 2 count now. Well hit the other way and it's into the gap. Around first he's digging for second. And he'll pull into second with one away. But baseball is a game of streaks and runs, and he is on one right now. Yeah, and you've got to ride these streaks as long as you possibly can, and he's doing that coming in right here. Came into this game on fire with the stick, and he's doing that here. That's now two hits so far for him in this one. It's a lot easier to hit when you're putting yourself in good hitters' counts. This guy's done a great job not swinging at pitchers' pitches, and when he's getting the ball in his own, he's getting the barrel to it. He's been hot lately. Oh, and you can tell he wanted to hold off, but he swings through the inside pitch anyway, and he becomes out number two. Up the next, man. Roman the Quinn, runner in scoring oh, position man. with two gone. One ball, no Win. strikes to count. Real Muto at second with two down. Fastball at 94 miles an hour, and it's one and one. Pat nibbled the corner there, but missed two and one. Fastball is looked at for strike two. two, balls, two strike. And it's fouled away. The 2-2 two, two, one more time is laid off and the count runs full. What we're seeing here is a really smart at bat. They got to be thinking that they got him looking and that'll do it. The inning is over. Leading off the inning, it'll be Freddie Freeman, and they could use a spark from him here. Right there for strike one. A couple of lefties start. The wind up and the 0 1. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Quinn is right there, one down. The the and here's Ronald Acuna Jr. now. No hits to this point. Lifted in the air toward the line and right. Harper has a read on it, and he makes the catch for the second out. Now 
it into the box. Yes. Marcelo Zuna over yes. two with a fly ball and a ground out on his line to this point. Out in front of it, strike one. Offensive game plan needs to change right here. They need to get a little bit more aggressive. It's too late to try and work counts. That's taken. Now it's 0 and 2. There's another pitch for a strike, and this guy's really attacking hitters well tonight, being aggressive early on. And if he continues to throw strikes like he is, he's going to have a pretty good night. Throw on to first, gets him, and the side is. Now to the plate, the pitcher, Aaron Nola. He's been great on the mound, so we'll see if he can do something with the bat here as well. He's earned a chance to take this out. Nola. This ball will be chopped foul. A little behind on that swing, and now he'll try to shorten up maybe and protect the plate. Here comes the one two. Lofted in the air out toward right center. Right fielder is on the run. He can't get there as it falls in. He came to play today. Now back, the third baseman. On his way out to the mound now is the Atlanta skipper. And he's looking to the bullpen here, so it would appear that's all for his starter tonight. Oh, and this deflects right off him. One there, but they won't get two as he beats the relay to first. So a runner at first now with one away. And that'll bring in the middle infielder, Gene Segura. Owen won the count. From the belt, the pitch. This is on the ground over to first. Freeman's got it. There's one. Relay to first in time. And just like that, this. Here's the catcher, Travis Darno. It was a base hit last time up. Here's the first pitch to him. No balls and a strike to count. Nothing in one count. Here it comes. Swings through it for strike number two. Man, this dude is locked in on the mound. He's throwing each pitch with confidence. Back up the middle. And this is going to be through into center field for a base hit as the leadoff man's aboard in the eighth. First game of a new series, and he's already sitting on now three knocks right Third now. Base. The pitching staff might Austin. have to make an adjustment going forward. At the plate now, Austin Riley. And he fouls this one off. He's hitless in his two at-bats so far. Ball one taken just off the inside. These are the moments that don't always show up on the highlight film right here. Big spot. They have a chance right here. This guy mixes in a knock. They have a chance to get right back in this game. If not, if he grounds into a double play, it's pretty much over. Swing and a hard liner to center field. Quinn is there, and he has it for the first out. Now so a runner at first now with one away. And up next will be Christian Pache. He comes set. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch. Hit in the air down the right field line. Harper will come in a bit and put it away for the second out of the inning. Jason Kipnis will come up. Pinch hit for Atlanta. Number 22, Jason Kipnis. First pitch on the way. As he'll take a look at a pitch too low. It's ball one. 268, the average for him coming in. Five homers, 10 RBIs. And a strike to even the count. One and one. Can't waste getting a leadoff runner on in this situation. Someone's got to bear down and get a big knock. In front of the changeup, and he can't keep it fair. Two strikes on him now. Yeah, Matty, you see the same pitch three times in a row and you find yourself down one and two in the count. Your head starts to get on a swivel here. Is he coming back with it four times or do I have to sit on something else? Hit in the air down the left field line. And that will end up a foul ball. Fouled away. Darno, the runner at first with two gone. 
And he comes back with a fastball. Strike three called, and the inning is over. Josh Tomlin is on to pitch out of the bullpen in the bottom half of the eighth. Number 32, John. And he popped him up, and that's going to land foul. 0 oh, 1 the count to Bryce Harper. Now a fastball here that will wisely lay off and it's one and two. Hey if you're going to throw a pitch like that to this guy that's right where you want to miss any lower and he'll probably make you pay for it. Three and two now from 0 and 2 to 3 and 2. What a great at bat to start this inning off. Hey this could be a productive inning. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Ozuna is under it. One away. Now back. And that'll First bring up baseman. the Sacramento product, three. Reese Hoskins. Oh, He's working yeah. on a one for three thus far. Strike one to start the at bat. Nothing in one count. Here it comes. Hey. Grounded to the right. Freeman is up with it. And he'll take it to the bag himself for the out. Now that so the three. next hitter to dig in will be Andrew McCutcheon. He's got a McCutcheon. hit in three at bats to this point. And that misses inside 1 0. Oh. Hey, curveball that kind of backed up on him right there. Might have popped out of his hand just a little bit earlier than he intended. The 1 1. Pulls this one in the air out to left. Ozuna able to track it down for the third out. Three up, three down for Phil. Archie Bradley comes on from the pen, hoping to finish this one off here in the top of the ninth. First delivery to him. Ozzy Alves is in to start things off here as he looks at a called strike. It's nothing in one. You know, some guys just don't like pulling the trigger in a 0-0 count. They don't like the ambush tactic. They like to calibrate the speed, maybe pick up the break. They want to know everything your ball does before they pull the trigger. And he can't get out of the way there, so the leadoff man will be aboard to open up the, the inning. Next to dig in, Dansby Swanson, leadoff man on base, and we'll see what they have in mind strategy-wise here. And he'll stay with it here as he puts the squeeze on it for out number one. Now, that one. now into the box, Freddie, Freddie Freeman. He flew out in his last A.B. Almost, Matty. Almost went deep his last A.B. Certainly just missed it. With this guy's big power, he's feeling pretty good at the dish. Look for him to try and get on something and drive it out of the yard this A.B. And they'll have runners at second and third following the one-out double. Finally, a little the something center. for them to get excited about. Yeah, a rally can begin with a single swing of the bat, and this might be their chance right here. They've struggled to produce a lot of runs, but there he is at second base. A shot to the outfield scores him. Then who knows what kind of roll they can get on. Got to take it one good at bat at a time. Hey, this isn't going to be an easy save. These guys are making it work for this one. A ball and a strike. Hey, this offense has this closer in trouble right here. They have to find a way to keep applying pressure. I don't know. Everybody top step in the dugout. Get on this guy and make him nervous. Lofted in the air out toward right center. Harper giving chase. He makes the catch. Here comes the runner from third. But not in time as the run scores and the lead is trimmed to one. And that'll bring in Marcelo Zuna. Not much in the way of productivity from him so far, but he's got a chance to come through here in a crucial spot. Yeah, it's time now that he has to put the rest of those bats behind it because none of that matters. And he has come through extra bases, and that's going to tie this ball game. You know, Dero, in today's game, it's not easy scoring in the late inning, so that RBI base hit to tie things up, that comes at a really good time. Yeah, I say it's not easy. They got 11 guys in a bullpen, and I don't think a guy throws under 97 miles an hour with sink and cut. That is unbelievable he's able to get that knock in that big spot. Swing and a liner, but he will close fast out there in right field. 
Now at the plate, here is JT Real Muto. His history with Josh Tomlin is one for five. Here's the fastball that gets the lower part of the zone called for a strike. Barely able to make contact. Down 0 2 now. Nothing in two count and the pitch. High in the air down the right field line. Pache is over a few steps as he puts it away for the first out. Up next, Here's Didi Philadelphia. Gregorius. He went down on strikes ball. last time up. Yeah, he's got to put that one Red behind Warrior. him, especially with runners in scoring position. Those punch outs will stick with you a little longer. Two Ooh, balls and no strikes. Two and one after the foul ball there. Bases are empty, one man out. He's fallen behind now, three and one. And he lays off ball four. So now the potential winning run is aboard at first. Adam Hazley will be called upon here to hit with the game on the line. No balls in one strike. Now a fastball here, not close, and it's one and one now. Possible winning run on first, one man away. But gloved by the third baseman for the out, and he scurries back to first base safely. He's Scott Kingery great. will get the call here Number as he'll four. hit for the pitcher. Yeah. Here's the first pitch. Kingery. Hit in the air down the left field line. Ozuna is under it. And no problem with that one as we are headed for Adam Hensley is the new center field. Yeah, he hit it hard. That's all you can ask. You can't control the results sometimes, Maddie. Just unlucky with the place. Here's the first pitch. Didn't quite catch the zone there. Ball one. Some activity out in the bullpen now as a couple of left-handers begin to stir. I had him guessing that time as he's barely able to foul it away. The one and one pitch. Skied in the air to straightaway left. McCutcheon is under it. Makes the play one away. And the runner, not tagging, will retreat to second base. The batter, the batter will be Christian Pache. And a chance they walk him here to set up a double play that would keep the game tied. No balls and a strike to count. The 0 1. Slow roller down the third baseline. And there are two away now. Yo, Johan Camargo will look to provide a little two out thunder off the Number bench 17. as he'll hit with a runner at second Johan and two away. Camargo. As he'll go after the first pitch to him and comes up empty, it's strike one. 276, the average coming in for him. One home run and seven driven in. This one's outside, quite a bit off the plate that time. Go ahead runs in scoring position here with two down. Can't keep the weight back, and he falls behind one and two. Fly ball into straightaway left. McCutcheon is under it, and that retires the side. Your Luke Jackson please. comes up. Here's the first pitch. Alan Bone is at the plate here as he quickly finds himself Alan. down a strike. It's 0-1. Oh. Now some movement out in the Phillies bullpen as a lefty and a right-hander start to loosen. Inside corner called a strike one and two. And this is swung on and missed. And boy, they took care of a key man there. One away. Gene Segura standing in. And he's got a chance to bring in the winning run. The question is whether they'll even pitch to him. Fastball called for strike two. Possible game winners at second base here with one away. Now a ball hit hard toward first. 
But taking in over at first for the second out is that might have been extra bases if it no, were right three field. feet higher. Three. Here's Bryce Harper now. Five. He's gone hitless to this point. Had a great game up to this point, but none of that would matter if he could come through right here. A chance to be the hero. Five. Tries to shave the corner with that pitch, but it's one and one. It's one and two. I mean, he's coming right after him, Matty. Three fastballs in a row. Now a little tapper in front of the mound. This should get him out of it. And the inning is going to continue here as he reaches on an infield single. Next to bat will be Reese Hoskins. And a ball hit on the ground. A two-out hit and win it. Pass ball or wild pitch would do the trick just as well. Swing and a miss, and he's in the hole 0-2 now. That's why you call a challenge fastball right there, boys. I don't know. But we'll have to press pause as that strike three to retire the side. Runner at second now. Nobody out. And that'll bring up Ozzy Albies. The second base. Here's the first pitch. Ozzie. Right Ozzie. side, but it's well fouled. This has to be a productive at bat right here. I know you want to drive the run in and get the RBI, but you have to find a way, bare minimum, to move this runner over to third. Fastball well off the plate for a ball. And the sinking fastball called strike three, and that's out number one. Well, I'm glad to get another look at that beauty of a pitch right there. You can't spot a sinker in a better location because even if you do get the bat on the ball, there's not a whole lot you can do with that. Textbook sinker. Dansby Swanson comes on with one away as he looks at a ball. It's 1 0. Strike swinging, timing a little off on that one. His career numbers against Hector Neris. He's 4 for 13. The 1 and 1 pitch. Sent on the ground out to second. A dive and he knocks it down. And the recovery throw is too late, and there are two on with one away now. Here's the first baseman, Freddie Freeman. Big man will try to bunt his way aboard. And he won't take any chances on that one as this is scooped away in foul territory for the first strike. A ball and a strike now to the Braves' first baseman. Not a surprise to see that low splitter there. Anything with downward movement like that is going to be at the top of the list in a double play situation. Two balls and a strike to Freeman. Hey, lots of guys get too aggressive in a spot like this, but he's done a nice job of gaining some count leverage. This is to right field and deep off the bat of Freeman. See you later. Over the wall, a home run. And with one swing of the bat, they got the lead here in extra innings. That's always the fear, right? You get into extra innings, Dan, and everybody forgets how to play baseball, and we're all just trying to create a home run derby. But that was a heck of a swing to give us team the lead. It sure was, D.R. Now they're going to need the pitching staff to buckle down to get through this bottom half of the inning. Big swing of the bat, but you want to make it pay with the scoreless bottom of this inning. As he swings and misses at a first. Three runs already home here. A little quick on that swing, and he finds himself behind 0 and 2. Nothing in two count, and the pitch. A bouncer up the middle. Gregorius has it, and he'll whip this one over to first, and he gets his man for the second out. The, left the next to bat for Atlanta, Marcelo, Marcelo Zuna. It was an RBI double for him in his last turn to the plate. Yeah, he did a great job to go down and get that one his last at bat. But I got to think. Well, the first baseman is under it to make the play, and that retires the side. <laughs>
But the Braves do pick up three on the strength of this three-run home run. Last chance coming up. Will Smith takes the mound. Runner at second now. Nobody out. And that'll bring up the former National League MVP, Andrew McCutcheon. Strike one to start the at-bat. And it's quickly 0-2. From the belt, the pitch. You know, something to keep in mind, they're really burning through that bullpen, and this is only the first game of the series. Definitely could have an impact on the rest of the series, and maybe even the whole week ahead. Swung on and missed. He didn't even come close to contact on a ball way out of the now zone. Now. One out. The catcher. JT. JT Real Muto Real is the batter Muto. now as he looks at a ball 1 0. Hard liner to center field, and that's in there. Base hit. And they won't risk it at third, so they're at the corners now with only one away. Matty, it's hard to say right here. I got to believe they dove into the scouting reports on every outfield arm. He did not take an aggressive pass coming around third base bag right there, so I just think the third base coach had to hold him. Unable to find the zone with the slider. Fouled off. Lucky he got a piece right there. He was definitely late on that pitch after seeing a previous off-speed pitch. Sliders strike three called, and that's a pitcher's pitch right there. Two gone. Up next to Trying to hang a zero. Here's the pitch. Adam Hazley is in with two away as he takes a ball. One and oh. Tried to get some loft to that swing, but it's one and one. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. Has to be a challenge pitch coming up here. He probably doesn't want to flirt with loading the bases. Runners at the corners, two men out. Ah, and he strikes him out to end it here as they were able to get the possible tying run to the plate but could not cash in. Well, they had to put in a couple of extra innings of work, but hey, listen, a win is a win, and any win is good, especially on the road. And tonight's comes to an end, 6-3 to three the final. Luke Jackson.